pop star uh, Nadine Coyle joins us now from uh, Girls Loud. She, you had carbon monoxide poisoning, didn't yes. you? This was a few years ago. Yes. But just, and it was extremely serious. You, you say you, you and your family were just weeks away from death. It was a house. I was renting a house in LA and uh, it just kind of started where you, it's just you don't really notice it. You're like, I'm really tired. Mm -hmm. Is it with all the flying around? Is it jet lag? You know, am I getting sick? Is it a cold? Have we got a bug? Why are we so tired all the time? And then you would forget simple things like, I remember we couldn't remember the word for table. You're like, what is that? That, put it on the... Uh, and we couldn't remember what it was. It's bizarre. And it was, you know, the chest pains. I felt like I couldn't breathe. So I had went to the doctors and, and I thought there was something seriously wrong. And they checked for everything and they said, you're fine. And I said, well, this still doesn't explain why I feel so bad. And then when the blood test came back then, they said it was exposure to high levels of gas. But still, he hadn't said it was carbon monoxide. And when he says you're exposed to high levels of gas, you're thinking, where am I getting high levels of gas? I was like, what is he talking about? Yeah. I thought, oh, is it London? Is it smog? Is yeah. it, you know, God, what, what was I doing? And then when it was the actual guy in L.A. had seen that the boiler was faulty. There was a crack in it, there wasn't was there? Which obviously it. none of us were. You never really look at your boiler, do you? Oh, and you don't even know what you're looking for. So no. was that somebody who came around to look at the boiler off the back of how you were feeling?